How you doing? Welcome to Rich Tactical Supply. My name is Mark. Today, we got ourselves an interesting little toy. Now, unfortunately, this is for a customer, so I'm not allowed to take this one to the range. But, just a real quick note on this. This is actually pretty cool. This is, uh, <laughs> this is a Dan Wesson Discretion Commander in 9mm. Now, most of these you'll find, uh, well, actually, you'll find a lot of these in 45s and 40s and stuff like that. But this one's in 9mm. This was really cool. Um, <laughs> I like it because, well, I like 9mm. That's just me. Don't get me wrong. The other calibers are great too. But uh, anyway, Dan Wesson, discretion, uh, commander. It's a little bit shorter of a barrel um, with the uh, commander. But cool things about this is we've got the extended barrel, which is threaded. I don't know if you can uh, see that or not, but you can see the threads there. So if you're going to add suppressors or whatnot, well, suppressors, that's the way to go. Uh, it's got our, it's got a uh, Picatinny rail system right there for lights or lasers, whatever. Few other cool features that I really like. Actually, you know what? Let's start with a feature that I'm not really sure about. I kind of get it, but mm, is what it is. I don't know if you can see this or not, but the uh, yeah, there you go. The trigger is serrated. Now I'm assuming because I I've never really seen that before. I may have, but never paid attention to it. But I'm assuming maybe it's a better grip uh, for when you've got gloves or whatever, maybe to help with a uh, better grip on the trigger or whatnot. Not really sure. Not sure it's needed, but um, I think it's kind of cool. Anyway, uh, other cool things that I really like are the raised sights. Now, the front sight is a... Uh, is a night sight. Yeah, it's a front night sight. But, you know, you've just got the uh, the typical rear sight. But it's got that little dot to help uh, line it up. So that's really, really cool. But these are raised. So if you are using a suppressor, so if you've got a can on the front, you can see over it with the sights. They're raised. And the cool thing is, these are specifically designed so that they are flat, so that you can use one-handed manipulation, whether it's against your belt or against your boot or whatever surface is available at the time that you need it for. That is specifically designed for that. For that, I say that's cool. Um, grips, I kind of like. Um, it, it, it's got a good grip feel to it. It's got, um, you can see the, 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 the checkered pattern there and then a little bit on the front kind of gives it a better grip. So if your hands were wet, or whatnot, it would not slip out of your hand very easily. A um, few of the features that I don't like, but don't let that really sway you. If you're a fan of the 1911, this this is the 1911 platform, and if you're a fan of the 1911s, then then you already know. You know the uh, the grip safety, so that you can go ahead and properly fire with that being depressed. Um, I'm not exactly a huge fan on that, but you know, I understand why it's there. Now, if you're gonna use this as like an everyday carry, maybe an open carry, not necessarily a defensive carry, but you know, just in general, or maybe you're gonna go to the range or whatnot, you know, that's cool, definitely cool. Definitely worth it with that, doesn't really matter. But I am gonna say, I love the way this feels in the hands. I love how easy it is to get your sight picture uh, using this little, I don't know if you can really see that, but there's a little dot right there. And then of course you got your front night sight giving you a lot easier time to get your sight picture. Now, another cool thing about speaking of sight pictures, um, I don't know if you can see this or not, but the slide, the top of the slide is grooved. So you've got a bunch of little grooves all throughout here and back here. Now what that does is that reduces any kind of glare, maybe sunlight or uh, maybe, I don't know, flashlight or whatever, any kind of ambient light that may reflect on that and produce glare won't be there because of that groove. Um, I think that's actually a really cool feature. I feel like, um, I, actually I kind of feel like most handguns should have something like that, especially if you have a shiny finish. Uh, whether it's a nickel or whatever. 
but if it's a shiny finish, I feel like there, that, that you should have those grooves there to help reduce any kind of glare or risk uh, not being able to find your target. I, I think that's a good feature. So, of course, that's just me. Uh, other features, we've got, the, um, we've got your thumb safety, we've got your slide stop, all that good stuff. Uh, it's basically a typical nine, uh, 1911. This comes with a, uh, well, this one here is a 10 round magazine. If you were in the 45s, 40, 45, it'd probably be an eight round magazine. So being a nine mil, it's 10 plus one, good stuff. Now, not only does it come with this magazine, but it comes with a second one. That's right, it comes with a second 10 round magazine. So that's kind of a really cool added value. Now there are these, uh, you know, you get all your other stuff here. Of course, everybody needs the tools, tools of trade. Now, keep in mind that, um, you know, it's plastic. It's probably not one of the high test tools that you would really, really want to use, but it's there. But, you know, also comes with trigger lock, as with most guns now. Um, as I said, this is for a customer. These start at the base price of $1,900. Now, I know it's a little bit pricey, but the, uh, <laughs> the, the uh, actual MSRP on these is, uh, I believe, $2,100. So $1,900, it really isn't that bad. So if you want one of these, I, I would suggest you hit me up because these are actually... Um, I'm actually selling two of these, believe it or not. These, I actually had special requests from two different people. So if you want one, hit me up. I will definitely see what I can do about getting you one. The, again, this is the Dan Wesson um, Discretion Commander uh, in 9 mil. And uh, I believe these are manufactured. These are actually produced by CZ USA. Yes, CZ USA. I had to think about it for a minute. My brain just kind of... Anyway, but yes, if you want one of these, it's great. It's on the 1911 platform. If you are a 1911 person, if you, if you love 1911s, then this is probably the gun for you. This is actually really cool. So um, let me know if you want one. Anyway, um, okay, but enough about that. So... <laughs> I just got word that, you know, okay, you remember we were talking about uh, we're doing our own branded ammunition, Ridge Tactical Supply Ammunition, in whatever rounds that we can get a hold of, uh, which is pretty much anything. Most popular um, handgun ammo, most popular rifle ammo. So, you know, 9, 40, 45, 38, 357, the gambit, okay? Um, we're actually getting, it's shipping out tomorrow, our sample ammo boxes. We're going to have uh, three different t types. I believe we're going to get 9 mil. I can't remember if it was 40 or 45, but we're also going to get 223s. So this is going to be really cool because we got another video coming, and this is going to be fun because uh, I'm really excited about this, guys. I, you have no idea how excited I truly am. This is gonna be amazing. Uh, I'm, I can't wait to get this ammo out there. What we're gonna be doing is we're gonna put it up on um, gundynamics.com. That's gonna be the crowdfunding platform that we're gonna do this with so that you guys can pre-order your ammo and uh, in different quantities. I'm uh, still working out the details with, uh, with them on that and how we're gonna do this. But you're gonna be able to pre-order your ammo. You're gonna be able to uh, help back this project because gundynamics.com is really cool. If it's gun related, they're going to help you um, with your project. So, I mean, if you go up there now, there's there's two different types of firearms up there, different uh, target practicing. There's, there's just really cool stuff going on right there. So, um, gundynamics.com, that will be coming up here shortly, uh, soon with our link, with our ammo, so you can back that project, pre-order your ammo. And... Um, yeah, I, I'm really excited about this. As you can tell, I, I'm kind of uh, a little lost for words, but uh, I'm excited because I'm finally going to be able to put ammo in your hands at a competitive price, and this is going to be good. So, um, and then, yeah, I think we're going to keep it up there so that you can uh, go through and we'll do monthly bulk orders so that you can 
constantly order bulk in what you want. So we're, and of course, obviously we're gonna order bulk of what we want so that we can actually stock ammo here. Cause I mean, you know, what's, you buy a gun, you kind of want to go shoot. So why not? Hey, Mark, you got some ammo? Yes, absolutely. We've got ammo for you. Well, at least that's how it's going to be once we're actually good to go. But anyway, I've talked your ears off enough and uh, that's all I got. Hit me up if you want, uh, if you want one of those um, uh, Dan Wesson Discretion uh, Commanders in 9 mil. If you want one, let me know. Uh, like I said, I literally just got two orders for that. And this is just the first one that happened to arrive. So, and I wanted to showcase it because hey, let's face it, if you love 1911s, you got to try one of these out. So anyway, that's enough. Have a good day and look forward to the next video. Should be next week or the following week. We should be ready to go. And uh, <laughs> I'm really excited. And you should be too. Ammo. All right. Peace out.